Hey everybody, Nerd365, and I'm back with you guys with another video. And in this video, I'm about to teach you guys how to set two outputs on your PC. So that means if you want to set two headsets, or you want to set your monitor, speakers, and your gaming headset to both play outputs or sound at the same time, I'm going to show you guys how to do that right now. So first, you want to go down here, and you want to click on Playback Devices. Under play, playback devices, you want to set your device, your default device, and you want to also set your uh, default communication device. The communication device is the device that's going to output the second sound. So under here, if you see, I got my speaker set to default device. So that's my headset where the output is going to come out from first. And then you have my default communication device, which is my Toshiba TV, which is my center screen on my PC setup. So... After you go in here and you set everything that you need set, you set your main one first, and then you set your default communication, you go over to recording. Now recording, you go down here where it says stereo mix. If you can't see this, you can easily go in here and you can show all your other devices and things like that. But uh, you normally you'll see the stereo mix right here. And you go into your stereo mix, you can either double click or you can right click and you can go to properties, open properties, and in here you go to listen. Now listen is that second device that you're going to want to have the output coming out of. So you go in here and if you don't have this check, click listen to this device. Make this the second thing that you made as the as the second communication device. So you put that in there. That being my Toshiba TV being the second thing. You go down here, you go to apply. You click OK. And then once you're done with that, you will hear audio come out of your monitor and come out of your headset so you can control the volume whether through your headset or you can turn your monitor down and keep your headset turned up or whatever you might want to do I mean that's pretty much what I do I use this for streaming and I use it for also when I make videos like this so where I can have easier control over the volume sometimes I don't want to turn down my monitor so I don't want to go into the settings and all that I can just press mute with the remote and turn that down and still keep my headset on so I hope you guys learned something in this video I'll be back with more how-to videos for you guys I hope you guys enjoyed this I hope you guys learned this remember thumbs up my videos if you like it thumbs down if you didn't nerd 365 I see you guys next video and I'm out of here peace